Hey guys and welcome to another video in the No Hands SEO video tutorial series. In this video I'll be showing you how to get No Hands Indexer set up with No Hands SEO to get all of your newly created backlinks indexed as quickly as possible so that your websites can start um, seeing the results of those new backlinks as soon as possible. Now No Hands Indexer is it's an application that you run on your computer. It's a one-off payment of just $20 and it will generate somewhere in the region of 400 to 800 links um, to all of your newly created backlinks. Now this will get your web pages or your linking web pages uh, indexed and noticed by the search engines far quicker and uh, it's very easy to set up. Now you may have noticed in the settings tab of No Hands SEO there's a lot of indexing services uh, integrated with No Hands that are there for you to use but they differ mainly in the way that they don't run on your computer and also the cost is anywhere in the region of about 10 to 20 dollars uh, per month whereas No, Hand in no Hands Indexer is a one-off payment of just 20 dollars. Now I'll show you how uh, how we get it set up. So we've got No Hands Indexer already running on our computer, and uh, I'm going to go to the Settings tab and then to the Indexing tab, and uh, you'll see that there's a set of controls here called No Hands Indexer, and all we need to do is just tick the Send Confirm Links to No Hands Indexer option. So that enables it, and then we'll save the settings, and that's it. It's done. All you need to do now just to check that it's all um, linked up and working together is you can click the test no hands indexer option and you'll see no hands indexer is now working with no hands SEO and that's all you need to do. So from now on whenever a new new uh, link is created in no hands SEO it will send it over to no hands indexer. It's really that simple. Now to get those links uh, indexed all you need to do is just make sure that no hands indexer is obviously loaded and running. Now whenever a new link is created and sent to No Hands Indexer it will automatically load it in and it will start promoting it. Now even if No Hands Indexer is not running the link will still be there ready to be imported in the next time No Hands Indexer is uh, is run. So you know if you say for instance you forget to turn it on for a day or so and then you come back and you think oh no I've missed out on all those links getting indexed you haven't they're still there waiting to be indexed all you need to do is just load up the indexer click start and it will go and uh, that's really all you need to do you don't need to worry about anything else but if you really want to have a play around with it there are lots of settings that you can change like the amount of threads so say um, it's taken a bit longer to get your, your pages indexed um, a bit longer than you'd like you can bump up the number of threads and it will start getting through that list a lot quicker okay you can also limit the amount of posts that are done per page so say for instance you only wanted to make sure that each page had say 100 links made to it then you can just limit that to 100 all you need to do is just set 100 and uh, things you know they really are that simple if you want to use proxies you can you don't need to because there's no searching being done there's no page ranking being checked or anything um, it's all all done in the tool so all you need to do is once you've done that just make sure that you've saved the settings and they'll be applied and that's all all there is to it it's really that simple it's a, a very easy to use tool it's a very uh, inexpensive it only costs twenty dollars and you can get it from nohandsindexer.com and if you require any support for it you can always get in touch with me at support at nohandsseo.com or you can go to the the support forum at nohandsseo.com forward slash forum. The links for these will be in the, the description below so if you're not sure what they are just have a look in there and uh, you can get them if you have any questions, any feature requests um, by all means post them in the, the support forum or email them across. Um, I'm always open to suggestions so if you do have any ideas of, of what you'd like to see in the tool then just, just get in touch. Okay, well thanks for watching another video and uh, I hope it's been useful for you and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Okay, cheers.